This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update on this Tuesday, the 24th of October. Got a week to go, wrap it up, huh? So we're looking at 33,193 in the Dow, up 257 points after a pretty lousy session yesterday. But this is fascinating. We didn't take out the left side, 32,846 level in this arc formation. There's still a chance that we might have to test it. The diamonds didn't, uh, diamonds didn't, but look at this. This is the uh, inverse, the DOG, we're actually still short the DOG, fractionally made a new high, and I said to subscribers, we've got to watch to see if this doesn't become a little double top. This is one to one short. We're short from the August 1st um, recovery high. Now what we're looking at is, so let's just go through this step by step because important session today. Couple of, I'm going to go through some I'll show in a moment. Some of the really weak stocks have had a fabulous pop to the upside with earnings um, news today. So we've got up 261 in the Dow. I would say that if we we're able to get to about a, a plus 380 or 400 uh, between today and tomorrow, that might change the scenario a little bit for a, another pretty decent rally to the upside still within a correction phase. S&P, let me just run these quickly. S&P is now up 29 at 42.46. It took out the low of um, earlier in October uh, yesterday. A nice bounce today up 30 points looking at the QQQ index 100 uh, up sharply up 277 at 358.40. It also took out the left side low. So really just such a fascinating moment that we've got IWM Russell 2000. Uh, that's up $1.73, $166.76. Horrible action. Even taking out the uh, Melo. We're, we're looking at uh, gold. Uh, gold is pulling back some. It's down 12 at 1975. I'll talk about this, and I did speak about it earlier on to say that um, it's telling us quite a bit about the Middle East right now. Uh, well, let me just finish these up before we go to my show, the Tiger to Britain's Hour. Crude oil is down 46 cents um, at 85. And the TLT, is it finally going to rally? Well, it's up 25 cents at 84.50. Basil Chapman, I'll be back for the Tiger Commission's Hour. Also, check out my opening for the 80 News Center. See you in a